also, when I have a hump of clay, what I can also do is I can make a spout. I can throw a spout on the wheel. So uh, I'm going to create a sort of little knob. And depending on how tall you need your spout, uh, you start out. And you can simply, as we've talked about the power pinch before, you can sort of do the power pinch, but I'm also using uh, my thumb and my forefinger to guide this up, and I'm gonna periodically pinch and guide it up. But I'm also, I'm beginning, so my finger's all down in here, is, is down in the pot to here. So I'll make a mark thinking, okay, that's where I'm gonna cut this off. I'm gonna throw up the body from here up. So I do a power pinch, and I'm beginning, I wet it, and then I'm gonna, my thumbs are dropped back, so I'm collaring or choking it in. Then my finger goes back down in here and I'm pressing with my thumb and my forefinger against my finger and thinning out. You don't want this to be thick and heavy. You need it to be thin. So I'm thinning it out as I come up. And then I need it to come in more. So I'm gonna, my thumbs are dropped back. And so I'm pressing it in to make it taller and narrower. And as I press it in, it's getting thicker. So now I can throw more. So I can use a stick as a finger extender. So I can go in here and I'm pushing with against the stick on my way up. And I'm gonna go ahead and So thumbs are dropped back. You see my thumb is dropped back <clears throat> and I'm guiding it up and it's as I'm pushing it in, it's getting thicker. So then I'm gonna throw it up a little taller. The bottom doesn't is already thinner, it's just this <clears throat> middle part. And depending on how big your pot is, that's gonna dictate how big your spout is because you want some velocity for the material to flow out. I can either, um, I can finish this, this lip very sharply so that when the liquid comes out, it breaks and cuts. Or later I can cut this spout to be a different, um, to be, a, if I want it to be shorter, um, I can I can fuss with that as well. Okay, so now here's my spout. I can either use a wire or I can come in with my needle tool and sort of pick it up from here. And so that would be my um, teapot, teapot spout. Okay, so I'll put that over here. Alrighty, so that's throwing off the hump. So you can throw your lids, your uh, spouts, all kinds of things off of the hump. So you're taking a large piece of clay and centering what you need.